Hi, this is Thunder E from BorderWork.com, and today we'll be doing a review of the Hapag HD PVR2. So I'm going to be showing you some of the software and hardware features of the Hapag. Uh, now, one thing to note about uh, the device is that once you get it, please use the CD that you were given to install the Arc software showbiz as well as the drivers. Even if you've had, you've, you're, you previously owned the Hapag HD PVR1, um, just install the software and the drivers and the CD. It will make your, your whole process much easier. So looking at the Arc uh, software showbiz here, you have your editing profile where you can edit your gameplay clips. You can actually add transitions, effects, and also text. And um, if you go into the options here, you do have options for your YouTube accounts to add in your YouTube account. Of course, your aspect ratio and as well as your upload resolution, which is maximum at 720p. So hit that OK. And let's go to the capture settings. So you can see the Apog is lit up and... Um, the uh, system shows that basically there is connectivity with your your gaming system and the HIPAG itself and this will show up shortly so you can see here we have our our gameplay going on and uh, and what we have here is that um, we have our capture module where you can select a source, which would be the HAPOG or integrated webcam. You can see here we have HDMI, um, input and output. And we have device settings and formats. Our format we picked, of course, is MP4. Now, we can easily record our gameplay. Let's just make the screen show up here. By actually just hitting the record button. And that will automatically start recording gameplay for us. You can see it's about to start capture and we are capturing gameplay so let's do team deathmatch look for uh, something to play now the Hapag claims that there is no lag between uh, gaming uh, TV screen and screen time here there is a lag is about a second lag um, even though I have hardware acceleration on it's still about one second lag within um, transition so it's something that you will notice uh, I suggest you do not use the laptop screen to actually um, play your video games because you most likely die that way but give you an example mind my horrible gameplay as I go ahead As you can see, you're recording via HDMI. It's 720p. It also records game audio for you. Ah, oh, I got killed there. We have the lead. So there you have it. I'm going to stop recording. And you just hit the stop record button and uh, you are done there. So it's very simple. Uh, again, simple uh, ways that Hapag has made their, their system. Uh, it's not hard to actually use. Um, the, only, uh, the only issue I'll see here is that it... Um, so we can close this up. And we should have our files available for um, editing. So we can drag that in there and edit our files. We can add transitions and effects. Um, 
it, again, like I said, it's a very easy process uh, with what Hapag has done here. I can do that transition at the beginning. I can add this transition here. If I do storyboard or if I want to do a timeline. So again, it's a very easy process, and I think um, you know most fans of Apog would definitely enjoy this and like it. And uh, let's add that there. So you can see that there. So what we'll do is we'll edit the gameplay, add that for you, and so you guys can take a good look and enjoy. We'll add some effects to it. Uh, we're not going to use this one, but we'll add some effects, and um, we'll show you how the gameplay uh, works on the the new Hapag PVR HD2. Now, do I like it? Yes, I do. Um, it's simple. I do like the um, easy record button. You can just tap that, um, you know, if you are closer to the box or not. But it works well. You have HDMI. The cool thing is if you have a PS3 too, you can connect that at the same time and switch between sources. So you can, and remember in the capture mode, you have source, sources to pick from. So, um, sorry, uh, you can switch between sources there. But uh, if you have your, uh, PS3 or Xbox connected, whichever one is on, it will link that first to record. So I like that feature if you have two different gaming systems um, as well. So um, that's pretty much it, guys. If you have any uh, questions or comments about the Hapag HD PVR, let us know. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to all our pages on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. It's all board at work with uh, 2.0. So this is Thunder E saying thank you and always enjoy entertainment. Deathmatch. Put to them now. Show no mercy. Thank <laughs> you.